Well, howdy, hey, everybody. It is time for the February Horror Block. Yes, it is March, but I just received this. Uh, what day are we in? It is March 3rd, but this is the February one. I'm not mad, no rush to get this crap to me, but I am excited, so let's see what the hell is in this. Also, might I add, it is heavy, so I'm psyched. Alrighty, so as you can see, once again, the blood is dripping upwards. You know it's evil when it's doing that. Um, alright. Let's see if I can do this on camera. I usually like cut away to, um, to cut it. But you know what? I'm just going to... Oh my god. It's working, E.T. It's working! No, not really. It's doing it. I'm sucking. Okay, I know that there is a, well, obviously there's going to be a t-shirt, um, which the la the two from last month were pretty kick-ass, uh, and the one, I, I know nothing about the shirt from this month, but I think, let's see, there's a book, I don't know, I've, I've heard bad things, but I didn't really cheat, I kind of saw a thumbnail on a video and I was like, no, no, and I didn't watch the video, I kind of like just quickly scrolled upwards, so let's see what is inside. I really kind of want the shirt to be a mega surprise to myself, so, oh wow, there's some funky stuff in here, I have no idea what's in, oh my god, what? It's one of those slap wristwatches, which I have one that's white, but I love that that mouth on the inside. That's pretty badass. Slap watch. Oh man, security. It looks like this stuff would glow in the dark. This ooze. Not gonna lie, not super stoked about this. I'm happy it didn't leak all over the package. <laughs> you know, it's like, whew, that, that's a sigh of relief. Kind of interested in what that gray lump is. <laughs> but yeah, so this is gonna be like glow-in-the-dark zombie ooze. I will confirm that later, uh, you know, whether it does. Now here is the book, Bitten. So here it is. And I think one in every 50 people could have a signed copy. And I do not. At least I don't think I do. Pretty sure I would have come across it by now. Were any of you guys out there one of the, the lucky people? I will read this. Um, it seems like this is the month of books. Because in Loot Crate we got uh, a book... Um, what is it? Uh, Ready Player One, I think. Uh, when it comes to books, I'm very picky. I really, really like, you know, a good thriller, like a, a suspense, you know, not necessarily like horror or, um, uh, you know, like a sci-fi or whatever. But, but, um, I have read tons and tons of books and never judge a book by its cover, I may totally be into this. So it's a book and I like that they are including stuff like books in boxes. I don't know how other people feel about that, but I am actually excited. All right, once again, I'm avoiding this thing. Uh, let's see. Oh, and I forgot, I still have a t-shirt to look at. Okay, here it is, Giant Monster Man, the Room Org. Wolf Cop. Looks like a fun old issue. Oh, did you see that? There was an ad for Horror Block. Fun stuff. And beer. <laughs> Awesomeness. Frankenstein Underground. 
Alright, cool. It's always fun to look at these, and I like this cover. Very, like, old school looking. Um, alright, and... What in the hell is this? Oh, it's one of those virus things? Ah, uh, didn't they give these away, like, in a nerd block or something? Now... Oh, it's a zombie virus. All right, okay, that that does work. And that is kind of funky looking. I do love, you know, plush garbage, so. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. It's just a, you know, a, a weird plush virus doll thing. I don't know. What in the... That's interesting. Not too jazzed about it. Especially because, like, here we're getting... You know, like, I consider this to be kind of like a zombie item, too. Like, we're getting three kind of, like, zombie items, you know, this month. And then, like, in there's going to be two Walking Dead things next month. It's like, ugh, can we, can we get outside of the realm of zombies? Alrighty, and here we go. A t-shirt. And it looks like Bride of Frankenstein. Not sure how crazy I am about this shirt. Hmm. It's very, like, El Dia de los Muertos with, like, the skulls and everything. It's just very plain. It's not an exciting shirt, but I must admit I don't I don't own any Bride of Frankenstein shirts. So, not that bad either, but so far I'd have to say this is my least favorite shirt out of all the horror block shirts I've gotten and I started getting the shirts with Hannibal so I don't know it's cool I I mean I can't say that this is like my favorite representation of a uh, uh, Bride of Frankenstein either you know it's just very blah I don't know I think I've said I don't know quite a few times so uh... This might be my least favorite horror block to date. Alright, and here's everything that is inside. And this has the Liana Vomp, Liana Vamp, uh, stamp of approval, which is the watch. <sighs> Slap it, bite it, vamp it, stamp it, watch it. This slap watch is Liana's uh, pick of the month. Never lose track of the midnight hour again. Or, for all the vampires out there, keep track of the time dawn breaks. You know, just in case. Oh yeah, okay, my bad. I, I was like, oh, it's kind of like a zombie item, but no, it's like vampires. That is cool. I mean, I, I, I do like it. It's actually smaller than my other one, I think. I'll have to find it. Like I said, my other one's white. Not sure if I said that. And it stopped. And this one is still going. Alright. Yes. It says glow in the dark. So, I know Johnny is going to enjoy that if you watch uh, Johnny Tayez's uh, videos. Uh, uh, you know, considering they're, I don't know, to me, there really isn't, like, a big ticket item in this. It, it's, oh, I don't know, hard to believe, like, the thing I'm probably the most excited about is the book, and that's not even really the kind of book I read. The, the virus is different. I don't know. What? How do you guys feel about this um, horror block? Are, are you a fan? Are you not? And also, if you got one of the signed copies, that would be cool. Like, you know, I want to see your videos, so, you know, tell me if you got one, and I want to see you unbox it. But yeah, overall, um, man, it's just hard to say what's, what my favorite thing is. Oh, man. Because, yes, the value is here. I mean, that I'm not gonna, you know, downgrade. I really, truly feel this is, you know, like, 30 bucks worth of, of crap. But it's not my kind of crap. Um, 
Mm. <laughs> Which, you would see my room and you might argue that. Oh well. <laughs> anyway, I hope all of you guys out there are doing well, and I'll see you real soon with another unboxing or more randomness. I hope all of you guys are doing well, so take care and bye for now. <laughs> Oh! <laughs>